people say to me, oh, a lot of things are broken in the response to COVID in the US, the response has not been good. The one thing that hasn't been broken is the research infrastructure. Phase one is the one where you, it's, it's, it's about safety and immunogenicity. So you take a very small group of people, healthy individuals, that you give the vaccine to A, determine if it's safe, and B, determine in a case of vaccine if it produces a, a, a antibodies. You try to define the maximum possible dose that is safe to produce a maximum antibody response. And for that, you go into different populations. You may take younger, older, especially older individuals because they don't respond as well. This is sort of the, where the rubber meets the road. This is where you take people, you give the vaccine, you compare it to placebo, large populations, to see if it actually protects. skipping any stages. It's just being done at a very quick phase. It's just being done faster than it would normally be. The time from virus identification to the first injection in humans was 65 days. I mean, that is the speed of light. That is so fast. That is just unbelievable. Hey, thanks for watching. If you like this video, check out these other videos from USA Today to stay up to date with all the latest news.